Doesn't quite do what I thought it would. Hmm. Not picking that up. Hmm. All right then. Um, what else we got? So, yeah, that does not do what I thought it did. So, hmm. Hmm. Okay, so go coming back up here was a waste of time. So I need to figure out. Hmm. It's huge. I can't open it. So that door's still closed. I can still go to the festival over here for some reason. Why is there even a festival here? There's only one place I can go. Hmm. Because, hmm. Petrified Forest. Hmm. And Rubicaba. Hmm. What was that? Hmm. Hmm. Got nothing. Wait, I really need to experiment a bit, so... Huh. Wait a second. I keep meaning to mark these cards. What? Okay. It's just... Huh. Is there a... Oh, hold on. Um... Can I do something with these cards? Does Manny have, like, a... Does Manny have something I can do with, with these cards? Or what? Hmm. I don't even know. Hmm. Interesting. Just a second. Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. What? Wait a second. Why can I do that? Why can I do that with the cards? What? That, that doesn't make sense. I couldn't play this card there. Well, I mean, of course you couldn't. Why can I hole punch the card? Why can I do that? Hmm. Considering there's this festival over here, and there's a clown I can talk to... Hmm. Looks like some sort of crafty mind. Hey, what's going down, clown? A back off suit. I'm practicing. Wow, okay. Hmm. Practicing, practicing what? what? Ring in your neck. What does it look like? Wow. Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? Jeez. Some festival, huh? Yeah, yeah. Pretty busy. My carpal tunnel syndrome's really acting up. But you don't wow. have any tendons. Yeah, well, you don't have a tongue, but that doesn't seem to shut you up, now, does it? Wow. Okay. Can you teach me how to do that? Well, um, since you're a beginner, why don't you practice the first step, which is blow. Bang. Ah, pop another one. Lousy bony fingers. <laughs> Bet you can't do a cat. Shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. I can do birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead, name one. Uh, Robert, Robert Frost. Frost. Trying to stump me, eh? Ta-da! Achievement unlocked, lousy, bony fingers. What? Why? Hmm. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, uh, jeez. What now? Okay. A cat. <laughs> no problem. Ta-da! Thank you. Alright, so... Balloon animals. 
Sure. What what purpose does this serve? And there goes my OBS capture. I just found out what happened, so uh, I accidentally clicked my Destiny 2 scene. <laughs> that's uh, that's a problem. I really should have like a scene for all my games, but I mean, I don't because I mean, this isn't for streaming, so it's fine. Oh wait. Um hmm. So what can I do with these balloon animals anyway? There's got to be something. So that demon talked about, like, gumming up the works or something. If I go over here... Huh. Hmm. One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Can I...? Huh. This doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. It really doesn't. This... what? Okay, that doesn't do anything. What? Huh. Okay, what about... what about the cat? What? I really don't understand what's going on here. Huh. This doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. Really doesn't. It's a squeaky little kitty. I really don't understand what I'm doing right now. Give me a second. All righty, let's try something else. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. jeez. Uh, what now? Uh, a dead, a dead worm. worm. Heck, that's easy. A dead worm. There's no limit on those. Okay, thanks. Can I get another one? Looks like some sort of crafty mine. My kid. Uh, do you have any more dead worms back there? Well, sure. Thanks, I guess. Okay then. Huh? What's with this white? Hmm. That's not what balloons are for. No, no, no. The bread of the dead. Since I really didn't get to celebrate the festival this year, I think I'm entitled to a little pan de muertos. Pan de muertos. Bread of the Dead, and that's just that's just that's just a that's just an estimated guess of what that means. I mean, I don't speak Spanish, but but I know Muertos is dead. So, hmm, can I can I fill? Huh. Let's see, cat. Let's see. Can I? Did I? Okay, there we go. Huh. How much stuff can fit in your suit, Manny? Because, oh my god. There we go. That's it. Uh, can I fill... Can I fill this one, too? I feel like... Hmm. I feel like filling those... Filling those has got to do something. What if I send those in the mail... If I send... If I send it in the mail tube, that... Hmm. Hmm. If I go to the mail tube, that might do something. What is that horrible squeaking noise you're making? New shoes. Alright then, uh... Can I... Hmm. Alright, can I send... Can I send this down? I wonder. <laughs> Look out below. Huh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Uh hmm. So is that supposed to do something? I don't know if that was supposed to do something, but let's see. Let's take a look if that was supposed to do something, because I feel like it was supposed to. Hmm. Let's see. That is to the chemicals. Need to go this way to get to the sun. Uh, get to here. Hmm. There's that light chemical all over in there. Huh. 
Okay, so... What... What is that... What good does that do? Does that do anything? Hmm. Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. Touch. Huh. I... Hmm. I'm, I feel like I might need to send the chemical... I might need to send the other one down as well. That might be... That might be a good thing. Let's see. Let's see, maybe if I send the other one down, maybe that'll, uh, maybe that'll help. So, jacket, uh, fire extinguisher. Here we go. This balloon is filled with a light chemical. This balloon is filled with a light chemical. Yeah, I know. All right. Let's put it in. Let's see, this is, is does this do what I, th hmm. I'm assuming... There it goes again. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe... Maybe that's it? I don't know. Let's check it out. Hmm. Maybe it, Maybe that's it, but we'll see. What? Okay, this doesn't seem to be doing anything else. As a rule, I never touch anything more sophisticated and delicate than myself. Okay, maybe maybe I'm still a little far away. Hang on. Can I get another dead worm, please? Thank you. Yeah, I, I messed I messed up. I, I accidentally used two reds. And Manny said both of them together make a solidifying compound, so yeah. Uh, if we go back in here, let's see. Let's get the let's get the empty balloon. Empty balloon. Here we go. Let's get the red. Okay. That should be better. And now let's send this one down and. Uh, and see if the see if the servers get messed up because uh because I, I mean I really I think I think this is the way I need to go but we'll see let's see it's gotta be it let's see scythe balloon here we go that'll do hopefully Let's see. Oh boy. Uh oh. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. It really doesn't, does it? Hmm. Let's go back downstairs and see what happened. Servers down again. What else is new? <laughs> All right then. So servers down. Um. Let's see what ha let's go see what happened. Hmm. Oh, well, okay then. Hmm. Hi, I'm not getting any messages. Is the server down? This is their idea of a joke. They think it's funny. I'd like to jam their tubes with packing material. See how they like that. Oh, hmm. So you're saying the server is down, is that it? The server is not down. It's never down. It's just temporarily unavailable while I'm doing some maintenance, that's all. Okay? So how long is it gonna be down? With a job like this, you can never tell. Probably hours. Or until no one's around to see you sneak out, eh? Whichever comes first. <laughs> All right, then. Can I squeeze in there just for a sec? Are you kidding? This is a highly secured area. No one's allowed in here who ain't me. Well, then. 
What's so special about you? I, sir, am an there. elemental yeah. spirit, summoned from the land of the dead itself. Well. Yeah, yeah, let me guess. You were given one purpose, one skill, one desire. Fixing pneumatic tube switchers. No, I was created to run the elevators, but they put in those dang motion detectors and put me out of work. Oh, well then. Just a second. Okay, let's see. Who would do a terrible thing like that? Terrible thing like this. It's those punks in the mailroom. They think this baby is going to put them out of a job. And they're right. Oh, hmm. You know, I really think it's clean enough. Oh, it's clean enough to run all right. I'm just fiddling around to be safe. You know, gotta cover my ass. Yes, you do. All right then. Just curious. How'd you get in there? I squeezed down one of these tubes like a pixie. How do you think I got in here? Through the door, just like you. Say, uh, chatty coffee. I got a lot of tubes to flush here. Hey, me too. I'll let you go. All right, then. Can I do anything else in here? Hmm. Oh, of course he hmm. Oh, not again. Oh. Uh, 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 uh. You trying to blow this joint sky high? That's a magnesium compound fire extinguisher. Spray oh. that on this packing foam, and we'll both be riding the giant Roman candle out of here. What? Why would they put something so dangerous in here? Exactly. Yes, they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste. Okay then. I squeezed down one of these tubes like a pixie. <laughs> Sorry. Huh. Okay, so he's working on the servers. What else can I do? Can the card be used for something? Maybe. Hmm. I couldn't play this card there. Okay. What else can I do? Hmm. Maybe if I. Wait, can I leave? Oh, okay. Good enough for government work. Huh. All right then. So the demon leaves. Maybe I can get back in here. I couldn't play this card there. Put it away, Manny. Wheel won't turn and the door won't budge. There must be something else keeping it shut. Okay, well, uh, that doesn't seem like I did the right thing. Alrighty, so I think I forgot to do something to the door because I can't get in now. So I'm trying. I'm gonna. I'm gonna break. I'm gonna break the server again, and uh, I'll see if I can do something with the door to like. Do I'm gonna see if I can do something with the door to like fix it, you know? Alright. So jacket. I wish I knew I wish I knew some quick keybinds. You know? That'd be great. Alright. Put this in. And break it again. Alright. So server should be broken again. Let's go. Uh, let's go see if I can get inside and. Servers down again. What else is new? All right, servers down. The demon's probably going to be upset, as usual. And let's see if I can do something with the door to like keep it open. Hmm. The wheel won't budge. How do I make the wheel budge though? Wait a minute. I can. I can. Interact with the handle here. What is up with that? Huh. The deadbolt looks like it's not set. Oh, set it. I've just locked an open door. Strange, yet symbolically compelling. Okay then, now I talk hey, to him. I'm still not getting any I'm giving you Alright. Are we good? Uh Okay, good. He leaves. Good enough for government work. Okay, that's better. Now I can get in. Now I can get in because this door is actually open now. That wheel should open it, not 
picking that up. No, don't pick it up, Manny. Oh my God. Okay. Hmm. I think that's the other end of Domino's message tube. If I could just get in there. Huh. Not picking that up. Don't pick it up. It's locked. Should have figured. What about the? Maybe now this will be useful. Hopefully. Mercedes Colomar, client number nine three zero eight. Blah blah blah. Died of chicken pox. Time of death. Yada yada yada. Aha! Positive attributes. Volunteered time reading stories to dying children. <gasps> That's good. That's really good. I think you're it, Mercedes Colomar. I think you're the one for me. All right then. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? That was a company car. Oh yeah, and it's even better company now. I'm in. Really? Why is it on fire? Okay then. This is very interesting. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? No. You're not <laughs> here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? Nope. But there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calaveda. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche. Meche. I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? Nowhere? What? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. Oh, um... Mm. Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. Oh, hmm. Mm. Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. Very little. <laughs> were you a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. Oh. Aww, that's so cute. Eh. I give up. Don't say that, Manny. Hmm. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? Eh, maybe later. later. Well, hurry up, because it's going to be cremated soon. Okay, then. Excuse me. But I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble. But please, call me Manny. Okay then. Um so now what? So I need to go I'm sorry I let you down, Manny. You you didn't let me down yet? Hmm. What about Hmm. Hey, funny bones! Hi. In my office! Now! Oh no. Vandalized company property in order to obtain secret information so you could take your illegally modified company car and your unregistered driver and run Domino here off the road. All in order to steal a client from her legitimate agent. There's nothing legitimate about this place. You give all the good clients to Domino. He does, and yeah. Now I'm embarrassed for you. You've embarrassed the whole office. I'm going to call the woman in here so you can apologize to her yourself. Ava, send in Ms. Colomar, please. She left about 15 minutes ago, sir. She said she had a long walk ahead of her and she wanted to get started. Walking? She had a ticket on the number nine. Why does she think she has to walk? That's the best package I could find for her. <laughs> now you see why I give all the good clients the domino. Wow. That woman was a saint and a shoe in for a double end ticket that she's not going to get because you just couldn't find it. And now, because of your little stunt, she's out there on her own, walking by herself through the petrified forest, facing the demons of the underworld alone and unprotected. This is her reward after a lifetime of hardship and public service. Oh boy. Her destiny stolen by some overreaching salesman looking for a fat commission he didn't deserve. Get in there and stay put until the boys downtown tell us what they want done with you. Someone's gonna take the fall for this, Calavera, and it ain't gonna be me! 
Uh oh. Oh god, we're wait, are we locked in here? Hey! Is anybody out there? So Manuel, have you thought about what you have done? Who's out, Who's out there? there? I'm you, or rather, I was you years ago. Yeah, well, I'm me now, so get lost. What are you? What? Mm -hmm. Get me out of here. The only way out, Manuel, is to be taken back in. If you are truly still loyal to this company, declare it loudly. The management might hear and stick you right back in their fold. Really? Yeah. Well, I got something they can stick in their fold. You have to try harder than that, Manuel. A man's loyalties decide his destiny. Really? My loyalty's still to the DOD, believe it or not. Hmm. Good boy. You oh. just keep up that spirit, and I'm sure you'll get out of here soon enough. What? Okay, what is going on in here? Hmm. It looks like it dispenses something called Philodent. Philodent? Hmm. I don't see anyone out there. Not picking that up doesn't open. Doesn't open, should have figured. Does this do anything? Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. Ew. Doesn't open. No, not the- I don't see anyone out there. Not the window! Okay, so, uh... Hey, guard! Hi. How's my little Count of Monte Cristo? No. No, really. Who are you? I'm a fellow prisoner, my friend. Maybe, but your cell's a lot bigger than mine, jailmate. <laughs> what are they gonna do to me? I don't want to alarm you, Agent Calavera, but have you ever seen a man sprouted? Sprouted? Yeah, I saw this boxer get a pretty bad cauliflower here once. Then you don't know. There's nothing more horrible than the bite of the sprouter. Its deadly stinger spreads a green disease through every calcified pore on your body, leaving you veined with roots and flocked with grass, steadily growing thicker and thicker until you crash and bloom out in oh. a horrifying bouquet of pain and fragrant suffering, screaming until your mouth fills with petals and your nostrils shoot out thorny stems. All right, and then. Bulbs sprout in your eyes, leaving you nothing but a patch of wildflowers on the ground swarming with butterflies are you done yes no i've never seen that okay then um look you gotta open the door for me amigo if you are still loyal lay down and roll over and bark the company fight song i know <laughs> all right then uh the dod runs a crooked game and i intend to prove it you would do that that could cause this agency a lot of trouble who cares I'm gonna blow the lid off this place. Young man, you are an enemy of the Department of Death. Welcome to the club. What? Salvador Limones and guest. Where are you taking me? To the headquarters of the LSA. LSA? The Lost Souls Alliance. We're a small group, Manuel. We're always looking for new soldiers. What? Huh. To do what exactly? We need help in our intelligence unit. You know Eva, of course. Manny? I was once a reaper like yourself, Manuel. But I uncovered a web of corruption in our beloved Department of Death. I have reason to believe that the Bureau of Acquisitions is cheating the very souls it was chartered to serve. Really? I think someone is robbing these poor, naive souls of their rightful destinies, leaving them no option to march on a treacherous trail of tears, unprotected and alone, like babies, Manuel, like babies. Oh. What's your evidence? That's where you come in, Manuel. Or should I call you Agent Calavera? Manny suits me fine. I'm not looking to join any military organization, Sal. I just want my job back so I can work off my time and get out of this dump. Well, you won't even be able to get out of this city without my help. Really? Which means, of course, you won't be able to find that woman and you'll never get your job back. When you're ready to join the cause, my friend, come talk to me. We might be of some use to each other. Okay, then. 
maybe I should uh, maybe I should call it here because I've been I've been going for a while and uh, I'm I kind of have to kind of have to edit all the stuff out that I did that just didn't work so yeah that'll be it for the first session of Grim Fandango I hope you guys enjoyed getting started and uh, kind of doing some obscure puzzles uh, I mean to be fair Franbo had those too so it's gonna be like Franbo again Anyway, stay tuned next time for... I mean, I don't even know what's going to happen next, but, uh, I mean, of course, we're going to be talking to Sal, so, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later!